Jean Darling in consideration of her continuing support of hospice staff during their visits to Douglas Street. <laughs> to Betsy Fowler in consideration of tolerating frequent short-term cases when she really wants a long-term one. <laughs> Presented to Claire Gillingham, in consideration of service above and beyond the call of duty at all times. For those of you who are not familiar with Gary Gilmore, who's not here tonight, Gary's hair is about down to here. So Gary Gilmore gets his award in consideration of his ability to develop a supportive relationship with a family in which no one likes long hair. <laughs> <laughs> to Joanne Gingrich, the consideration of hours spent trying to communicate with the TV on. To Helen Govier, in consideration of being there in the pinch. To Jean Grossi, in consideration of being willing to be kept on hold. To Joyce Grossi, in consideration of her willingness to face potential rejection. To Warren Haas, in consideration of his quiet, listening ways. To Karen Hebert, in consideration of her willingness to keep on trying, even though she looks too young. <laughs> To Susan Hoover, in consideration of the longest first patient contact <laughs> on record. <laughs> to Georgine Hopwood, in consideration of demonstrating the specialness of just being there. <laughs> to Mary Kendall consideration of her ability to make patients, families, and hospice staff feel supported. Oh. To Colleen Lanza, in consideration of her willingness to help in very practical ways. To Harriet Lundberg, in consideration of sharing her journal so that it may aid future volunteers. chocolate-covered cherries <laughs> and the carrying that goes with them. Bye. To Joan Benez, in consideration of staying with a tough situation and for jokes. To Martin Michaels, in consideration of her cheering visits to the office. To Ann Miller, in consideration of proving that someone from Michigan can be a good hospice volunteer. <laughs> To Joan Nelson, the consideration of the endless pages of typing from day one. consideration of being the only non-trained volunteer to be a volunteer and doing it well. <laughs> to Marie Powers, in consideration of being there when she's needed. To Karen Ranson, in consideration of learning that it's just as important to be able to receive as to give. Yeah, she's a belly dancer. <laughs> <laughs> to 
to Lillian Smith in consideration of bringing a little zip into the lives of our male patients. <laughs> if she were here, yes, she'd really be mad. <laughs> to Carrie Stafford in consideration of being a big help, even when she wasn't sure she could be. To Sue Stambro in consideration of the most hours of card playing in hospice history. <laughs> to Doris Thede in consideration of exposing a patient to the finer culinary establishments of Rochester. She takes her patient to McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> to Diana Tibbetts in consideration of her readiness to be available in spite of her own personal crises. consideration of his ever readiness to be of service. To Liz Wilson in consideration of getting through initial introductions even though they make her nervous. Thanks for being here, and enjoy. Thank you. Thank you.